Hey guys, so today I will show you my curly hair routine during the winter. This is seventh day hair. Can you believe it? Here is a closer look at the front, the sides, and the back. And of course, you know I had to do that slow-mo hair flip. But it's not even that cute. First, I deep condition. Today I will be using the Shea Moisture's Deep Treatment Mask. The consistency is pretty thick. I think deep conditioning is crucial in maintaining healthy hair especially during the winter. So I try to do it at least once a week. You just work it all throughout the hair. You can either add a little bit or a lot. And when you feel your hair is thoroughly coated, go ahead and tie it up into a bun. I always make sure to reapply to the tips while tying it up because that's what needs the moisture the most. Lastly, I add a headband. Since I'm leaving the product on overnight, I want to keep it off my sheets and make sure everything soaks in perfectly and tightly. And voila! So this is me right out of the shower. My hair is completely rinsed with no product. The first product I use is the Cantu Coconut Curling Cream and always work in sections. I think it's the easiest way to detangle and manipulate your hair and that way you can always thoroughly coat every strand with the product. The second product I use is the Shea Moisture's Curling Gel Souffle. But just a little bit, a little goes a long way with this product and it'll help your bank account because you, we know these products are expensive. And it's just that simple. Just make sure your sections aren't too big and repeat coating your entire hair with these two products. And I also like to pin down the sections that I'm not working with to ensure everything stays out of the way. And this is the last section. As you can see, the product really helps define and elongate the curls. So again, the first product I'm going to use is the Cantu Coconut Curling Cream. And then just a touch of the Shea Moisture's Curling Gel Souffle. And lastly, I use a light sesame formula by Neutrogena to just lightly coat my hair to add shine and seal in all that moisture. And of course, you just repeat the same process on the other side and the final product should look like this. And at this point, you can either let your hair air dry if you're staying in or if you're going out, I'd recommend using a blow dryer with a diffuser. Make sure to put it on a warm setting and on high. <laughs> so I was having difficulties keeping the hair dryer going, but at this point you can just toss your hair all around and just dry it to your liking. I didn't plan on leaving until later, so I did half and half. So this is the final result for me. It's still a little damp, and it will shrink a little more, but I kind of just wanted to get the hair out of my face. There I am scrunching it a little bit more. And yeah, so I don't wear my hair out like this every day and you shouldn't during the winter. So please comment below if you want to see a video on my everyday winter protective styles and please subscribe. Bye.